Well, hello, hello, my beautiful wolf pack. Ow! Welcome, welcome. If you're new, please hit that subscribe, hit that bell button so you could get the notifications, and also I appreciate the likes and the shares. That's the most important for the channel so it goes, you know, start building. I appreciate the ones that have come new and I appreciate the ones that are sharing, okay? Um, this month and next month, I asked, well, for this year, let's say this year, um, I wanted to do all the oracle uh, each video for every oracle card deck that i have um i already did um a couple of them which was the angel and ancestors i already did the star seed and the angel wisdom so if you want to go and check those messages out those are quick messages that i have for you guys which i'm reading from the booklet so every card that i have thrown for the oracles is going to be read from the booklet i'm gonna give you the whole ex the whole message okay so this one is going to be the wisdom, the um, which is wisdom that I'm going to give, okay? So I hope this is going to resonate with you. You know, it, there's, uh, there are quick messages. It's not something that, you know, it has to be like, oh, I, it doesn't resonate with me. It's a message given to you that's, that for you to pay attention for this year, okay? Now, I'm going to clear the um, energy, bad energies around. Still going okay very nice all right and i'm gonna ask my beautiful guys to please bless and protect the space i ask that you ensure only chose trustworthy answers come from the divine through these cards i ask that you let me see hear feel and know the messages you have for my wolf pack and i ask that this reading brings blessings to everyone involved so it is so be it i apologize i always put that here so you won't see the keyboards of my computer but i forgot to put it so hey who cares, right? <laughs> so let's see what messages they have here for you. Oh, these are very tough. They're tough that way. I don't understand why, but, you know, they're much easier to do it this way. So let me do it this way, right? All right, so let's see what messages they have here for you. What messages do you have here for my wolf pack? Guys, please, what messages you have here for my wolf pack? What messages you have here for my wolf pack? Let's see what messages they have here for you. For messages, I want to try to throw two cards. If they give you more, then I'll read more. But for now, I'm just want to throw two cards. Okay. Let's see. Wow. Okay. So, is there any more? Is there any more, please? And thank you. There's no more. Okay, there's say no more. All right. So, we're going to take these two. And we're going to throw, I mean, we're going to give you the bottom. It says, Watchtower of the South and Spirit. Wow. For summer. All right. I will read that one after I read these. Herbal Kitchen. Alchemist. Mm. Something is brewing. And then Chalice. Fulfillment. Oh, I love that one. Look how pretty. How pretty. All right. So we're going to go, of course, with, like I said, I'm going to read from here. That way you guys could get the whole extended message, the whole full message, okay? Just give me a second. Okay, so we're going to read for now the Herbal Kitchen, all right? And um, I'm going to read the Witch's Wisdom and the Witch's Foresight, okay? And it says, mixing, making, stirring, brewing, boiling, baking, frying, stewing, collecting plants and herbs to use. Selecting carefully now to choose. This magic is worked with harm to none. So multi be there it is done. You have a natural affinity with all kinds of plants and herbs. Experimental cooking, making potions, and plant medicine has always excited you. And you feel a witchy air about you as you add in carefully selected ingredients for your magical elixirs. Herbal Kitchen delights in confirming that you indeed are a natural kitchen witch. You have a strong connection with the element of earth and of course you plant kingdom. The plant kingdom. You are being called to step up and take your alchemi alchemical abilities to the next level. 
draw on your inner wisdom to work with plants and herbs to assist you in your spell work. Look into making alternative or natural remedies and healing sprays as well as delicious meals that you can tempt your family and friends with. The kitchen is where you belong and feel most at home. Time to cook up a storm. Which is foresight. Your ability to work with plants and herbs hails from the past life. Invest in studying plants. Your body may be giving you signals to eat a plant-based diet. Check with your doctor first. Write a book of natural remedies for ailments. Pursue your dream to cook. So this could be a specific message for someone who is telling you to start getting into healthy habits of eating and, you know, cooking. Okay? Then you have chalice, which is fulfillment. All right? So we have here. You seek it here. You seek it there. You're sure to have searched everywhere. Look no further than inside. It's here the magic doth reside. This magic is worked with harm to none, so mote be, there it is done. You have a deep thirst to connect with the magic of old ways. The overflowing desires to remember and awaken runs through your veins and speak of your very soul, to speak to your very soul. Your quest has led you to score the pages of books in order to learn of rituals, spells, <laughs> properties of herbs, and additional and traditional ways of yesteryear. The idea of covens to be initiated into the power of group of like-hearted others stirs your interest, and yet your natural solitary side encourage you to step away from the views of opinions and others of others to take your own path toward that which you seek drink from the chalice that stands before you for your search is almost over instead of seeking all the re all you require elsewhere chalice shows you that the fulfillment you seek and has always been inside you you are the one true vessel that is waiting to be filled. Now drink. Which is foresight. Your search is form your search is a form of procrastination. Be open to spirit and follow your intuition. You're real you're nearly there. Don't quit. Something has something that has been missing will turn up. You will receive an unexpected visitor. Work with the element of water. Check in, which, check in with your emotions. Drink more water. Again, healthy here. Okay? And then we're going to go with the witches. With the witch tower of the south. Okay? The witch tower of the south. Ignite the flames of summer and now. You are the power. The sacred glow. Love and passion stirred and invoke. Abundance is yours for the fire is stoked. The magic is worked. This magic is worked with harm to none, so mote be, there it is done. Calling upon the guardians of the gatekeepers of the south. The seasons of summer brings you love as it works in conjunction with the element of fire. By visiting the watchtower of the south, you are being assisted in awakening your kund kundalini. I don't know how that's spelled, but pronounced I mean energy through lust attraction and desire strength and power fuels the motivating life force energy that ignites your inner flame the south will accompany you as you walk your path with vit vitality and vigor connect with the mother aspect of the triple goddess and the father god who brings everything you've worked hard for your work is done Time to have fun and enjoy the abundance that summer bestows upon you. The color red represents the element of fire and should be used in accordance with your magical working at time of noon. Summer, bre summer breathes renewal, passion into your association with the card that flanks this one. Okay. And then you have witch's um, foresight. An old flame turns up. Romance is rekindled. 
New passion is breathed into a relationship. You are seeing the fruit of your labor. Your hard work has paid off. Enjoy the rewards. You have attracted the energy of abundance. Draw down the sun. Mm. <laughs> I'm loving that. I love it. So I hope you take this please and put it in your pocket. Pay attention to the messages, okay, for this year 2022 from the Witch's Wisdom. Okay, so I hope this resonates and you take it again and share it. I thank you so much for joining me. Love and light. Take care now. Bye-bye.